Fuck! <laughs> why? 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 Hey, Gaming Tales, but I'm not my lady, I'm not happy. Why? You're the penny, but that's the good spider verse! For spider Gooden. Yep. And that's not all. A penny? Spider Gooden can have a now in minute for good. I guess Spider Go Ball and Favorite Character who got screwed over in Spider Man, which, by the way, I'm still mad about that slot. You can't empty two people out because of bullshit. And we're gonna have it to you. We need your bad. My name is Jane, which, for the record, I love being your bad, even though the little need to remain because I'm gonna do a second one to be a one. But I have been Conway. It's not Conway, great. It's, well, different, different letter. It's pretty good. Well, Joy Howard, which, Joy Howard is a good letter, but that book is. This is going down always way. Thank you, man, and apparently my life's gonna be involved too! Yay! Huzzah! More, more Spider-Verse characters! Wonderful! Ugh! Yes. So, do I find on this ancient, ancient news? Oh, I have some more intro, I think you can tell me how about this news. Why? Well, you'll find out. Let's get started. Um, according to all the time, we have a news alarm, and I quote, Mara had released a new teaser image for spider Get game. It's Spider-Man crossover event, Kicking off in August, Edge of, Edge of Spider Game issue one. So we're still going to do Edge stuff, eh? Whatever. What like Venomverse? Um. Well, specific details are still on the wraps. The new teaser marks the creative team writer Crystal Gage and the artist Jorge Molina. Yep. The teaser image, image brings together numerous Spider-Man of the multiverse, many of whom appear in 2015 Spider-Man crossover. Yep. And the spider Man issue 1, it drew out on Saturday, August 15th, near my birthday, so happy birthday to me. I get to eat some of my birthday, but get very close to it. And no, we just inspired again issue 1, so it's in. And at the end, they're all going on, so. Be a long time, so we're going to see the spider base. My thoughts on this? Honestly, why? I thought you were done with spider Man, but why are you doing that spider Man story? Because, don't forget, that, don't forget spider Man is the greatest card, which was. An ancient crossover that killed up Billy's last spider case for no damn reason, just for shock value. And I know Kurt Development and Peter Parker. And the people could be idiot, Mr. Peter Spider-Man, Dark Guy could be a, a math of mine. I still hate that to this day that many people could be a moron. And many probably screwed over in that book too, which. I'm still pissed off about that, but I love ancient Peter Parker. And we got. Let me talk. And, um. Then, then we had Venomverse, which is just another point is called Venomverse made no sense anyway. Venomverse just, we just pointless. That crossover went nowhere. And now I think we're getting, then we had Venomize, which was just bad. I, ignore Venomize, don't read that book, it's not worth it. And now we're getting spider getting. I thought we were done with all this spider stuff. I thought. I think when Kate Christmas Day was coming back on, he would put Spider Man back to back to basics. Not go crazy, but what I do Spider Verse 2. Like, can't we just stop doing motivated Spider Man characters and just focus on Peter Parker? No? Alright, um, that being said though. Alright. Yeah, I can tell about my experience, I'm not happy about it because I, I'm, just, I'm just tired of the Spider-Verse concept. I'm tired of the old multiverse Spider-Man appear everywhere in the main unit and going to open universes. Like, right? and much, and much to know, I'm happy to see, um, like, Mary Jane from the new bag in, in this, um, crossover. Which, by the way, that's cool. I love that. I'm, ha I'm holding Mary Jane talk to some of these people there, and she could tell her about Annie. And she goes to tell him Matthew about well in marriage. Now we have shocked me that they do that, but however the one another thing I'm happy about this is well obviously ultimate ultimate um Spider Man. Who for the record, old Spider Man me is on care, I love my character, I'm happy she's back. Finally some good news. Like I'm happy she come back on it. Like where's she been all this time? That that's that's not that's not part of coming out of this event. Um, oh, it's bowing. Yay! But, still. Now, wh what do I think the threat is going to be? Well, my best idea is going to be Morlin. Now, you probably have this Yeah, yeah? That's impossible. Morlin is dead, remember? He died. Actually, no, no, scrap it. He got trapped in a bunker. 
Yes, that's true. But if I'm right, and if, if it does come to pass, and it, if, if Morin does come back, if Darren come back, then... Well, shit. Well, that's not going to be good. But... If it's not Morin, if it's a different flight, like an always fine TV show did, then... Whatever. Like, who cares? Like... I don't know. I, I don't know what the point of having all these Spider-Man characters team up again because the last time they did it, it didn't really do well. It did just sort of it just bad. I thought the point of Marvel first start was to go back to basic, not have not do another multiversal crossover with Spider-Man. Like, God damn it, Marvel! Like, you you couldn't keep it simple. You just had to go with big and big epic Spider-Man crossover event again. Wonderful. Ugh, anyways, I want to talk about the news. Um, well, uh, 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 there's some good news going We have 29 coming back, which, yay, that's good. Yeah, those 29, a bad little costume, so that's a good. But I wonder, is that going to be actually his son, or is that going to be Miguel O'Hara? Because at the, at the end of his book, I remember something like that, uh, Miguel O'Hara went back to 29. So I want to call it that's his son. I'm not gonna buy it. I'm, I'm hoping it actually is his son. Wait a minute. Why is Zoom Zoom there? What does Zoom Zoom to do with this? I need to get the guns. That's not Spider in the War. Spider in the War is the black one. Not my. Uh, yeah. That's getting way too racist. There we go. Uh, also, also, it was a Spider Man comeback, which. Ugh, I am so tired of Space Spider-Man. Can Space Spider-Man just go away? Please? No? Shit. Why well, get we stuck with him? Yay. Huzzah. Whatever. Um, and okay, spider Bridge is back. So, I guess she got the other color with you, which makes sense. Because she's going to kill. Um, uh, spider Eye is there. So, my baker, this book is going to react to Bernard's book and cancelled, and he may die again. Because right then, right then Bernard appeared in a crossover, he died. So, I might get back there, I'm going to kill him off, in this book. And if I'm right, then and I, that won't be shot me. And Silk back. Yay. There's, uh, Silk. Whatever. All the spike went there too, which makes sense because she's part of the web warriors. So I'm guessing they did bring out all the public from the um Spider Man stuff, but no but no at the um Spider Mech creator. My bet is she's dead. And Spider Bump's there too, which that's cool and all fine. I like Spider Punk. But anyways I as far as crossover concern, I'm this tired Spider Man card over like can we fill out one story with no crossover event, no big ever event, Spider Man? Marvel, please? No? Shit. The, que the question is, though, why, what did the event gonna lead up to? Is this event gonna do Peter Parker a good security event by me? Is he gonna have to go talk to the Mary Jane by me? That would be pretty cool to see the new about Mary Jane talk to the Mr. Peter Parker because. Actually. Holy shit. Holy shit, I just realized something! What? What? Why did it be this big epic event? Is to wait for for Winnie the Rabbit Mary Jane to talk to Peter Parker and tell him to go back to Mary Jane and he'll undo one more day. <laughs> that's genius! Do you think that's gonna happen? No, of course not. I'm, I'm just wishing at this point, but I can dream. Anywho, what's up with the news? I think the good news is gonna be looking for Nick, like Crystal Gate. Not, not Gate, um. We look like Nick Spencer. And. No, 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 this is Gage. This Christmas Gage. Shit, my bad. Nick Spencer. I got that backwards. So. Looks like Christmas Gage will be going this story. Not SWAT. Thank God for that. So. I think this one will be good. Hopefully. Maybe. I'm just quite a big idea. We could just get either good or better. I think he can pull this off. Now. See, that Spencer's running it. I guess that's what he's having. So. Here's my best guess. This event will probably be a like, uh, Spider-Man event like, in 2014, and it won't affect the main book. Or it probably will affect the main book and get tie-ins, but I guess we'll wait to see what happens. Anyway, I'm going to win this point. 
So, uh, so, there we go. Alright. Final thought, I know Spider Geddon having to be a Spider-Man sequel. Like I said before, I'm pretty done with those Spider-Man's part of stuff, but since we are getting a sequel, I get to what it was to happen. I just hope we better plan for worse. And plan on this vendor is good with Ben in spite of us. But who knows that's impossible. Anyways. Good my part, I know Spider Gunning being a Spider sequel. Uh, please don't comment on what you think about it in the engine news. Do you like it? Do you hate it? Although, what's your opinion on Spider Gunning being a Spider Man sequel? Um, please don't comment on below. Also, I can feed me on Twitter. Please go and jump on Twitch, follow and start us, and I'll check out Twitter. Ugh, well, well, long a good Spider-Man story, and what this play got this event is good, and not disappointing. I just think it's gonna be disappointment, but who knows? I get to wait, see what happens, and we go. I'll check out Twitter. Long live Spider-Man, Spider-Go, and get many more in the event, Mary Jane. And Noah, see ya. Bye. Marvel, please stop doing events.